like to go back? Welcome to a new episode of Dragon Saga Let's Play. I'm Welcome. CM Dragonlark, and we have CM Oda and special guest Popcorn. Hello there, friends. Good morning. Um, if you guys are experiencing any issue with the sound, if Popcorn's too quiet for you guys, um, if you're having issues hearing us, let us know. We'll be happy to uh, adjust the quality of the live stream accordingly. Um, Today, we're going to be finishing off our Halloween quests. Last week, we did uh, the regular and the chaos mission maps. And I believe we're ready to do the scenario mode now. Okay. Um, I want to make sure. I, I clean out my inventory ahead of time, but I oh, feel boy. like we all may not be on that page. <laughs> um. If you guys haven't had a chance, check out the patch notes. There's some. Our Halloween event's going to be here for another two weeks. There's been some drop rate changes uh, and a couple of more updates. There's to the item all as well. Uh, I know there's some special surprises for the uh, the big wheel and um, mix board that people will be excited to see. So check that out. All right, let me make sure I have this quest. I have this quest, I think. No, no. Hmm. Oh, I see. It's in the regular one. There. Die, monster, die. That's the quest. Do you have die, monster, die, Oda? Uh, is that a hero quest or...? It's a, it's a regular adventure quest. Okay. Oh, we have another friend who wants to join us. Welcome. Uh, don't think so. Uh, I guess it's just talking to the... Okay, uh, Dead Man's Party. I just completed that one. Uh, let's see. Okay, okay. Die Monster Die. Uh, Jack O' Lantern, Werewolf, Heath, and Kill the Zombie. Yes. Zombie does not get a name, I guess. Alright, so if you guys are ready, I think we go into scenario mode now. Okay. Alright. Yes, scenario mode. Alright, let's do this. Yay! I haven't done this at all yet, by the way, the scenario mode. So, we'll see. I believe in us, though. Oh, this is so cool. Oh. I like the music, too. It's a little bit creepy. Which is good, because it's Halloween themed. And it's nice to hold on to Halloween since. It's Ooh, the day. This is a, a new angle. Oh boy. Yeah, this this computer is not. Uh, oh no. Ah, it's, it's been a little while since this PC's been restarted, since there's a lot of people who uh, use it. Ah, uh, yes. I see how that. Oh, uh, also, I should probably make sure that I'm. Uh, oh yeah, that would help. Just in case I don't want to. Disconnect in the middle of this thing. I might still if it doesn't recognize the uh, the, the net cable. Take that zombie. Well, our teammates are like kicking butt. Look at them go. Yeah. It's great. I can just kick back. <laughs> just get carried. Oh, that's cool how they kind of crumble yeah, I, into dust. I do like this camera angle a lot. Uh, it's kind of like a little claustrophobic. Oh, that's cool. Oh. Those okay. heels are really helping. Oh my gosh, there's stuff coming this way. 
It was like ghost motorcycles or whatever these guys oh. are. Oh, my gosh. I can already tell how I'm going to die here. <laughs> I can feel my lack of coordination. Okay. Oh, no. I didn't even... Ah! Ah! No? No. Yep. No. At least I felt the same part as popcorn. <laughs> <laughs> I don't feel as bad. You know, uh, whoever designed this, uh, this crypt is uh, not very safe. Yeah. Oh no. Okay. So popcorn, how is your day going? Busy. <laughs> always busy. My days are always busy. Yes. No matter if it's a weekend or a weekday. And everyone really appreciates <laughs> you uh oh, being so busy for Dragon Saga and also for joining us in our yeah. live streams. Definitely appreciate it. Uh, it's just a bit uh, relaxed. Oh, I see. <laughs> oh my gosh, there's clowns! Why are there clowns? Ah. So this is the vampire guy? I don't remember the vampire guy having clowns. Maybe I'm thinking of a different vampire guy. Boy, you know, the vampires and clowns are just like two sides of the same coin. No, know? they're not. That's awful. Ah, clowns. Die. Do not summon the clowns again. We can't be friends if you summon the clowns again. Ah. I doubt that you want to be a friend of Van Cliff. <laughs> yeah, of course not. He's summoning clowns. That's the definitive factor here. That's the real problem. I mean, the drinking blood, that was fine, but the clowns, no. Yeah, I mean, you know, he has to drink blood to survive. What does he need the clowns for? Ugh. To make him laugh. To make him laugh? No, that's awful. I like awful. a good laugh. Oh, yeah. I know. I'm undead. Oh, no. Cool death animation. Yeah, that was very, very cool. Woo! All right. This is, this is great. Yeah. Uh, so when's the last time? Is this uh, when's the last time this dungeon was in? Is it only for Halloween time? Uh, this um, this map is only for Halloween time, yes. But the, the crypt itself is part of the Van Cliff uh, Citadel. Oh. He's saying you it's will, part of. Go, you will go into it from. Level 60. Oh, level 60. Oh. There's a crypt. Oh, that's cool. Something to look forward to. I love the music in here. Actually, it's pretty cool to have these places kind of like places or ways to see future content. It's yeah. like, oh, this is way high level than me, but I'm kind of like getting to see what the monsters kind of look like and some yeah. environments. That, that is cool. When we have done this uh, quest, we could take the Zul quest. It's a short quest, but uh, fun. Oh, okay. We played, we, we played around with the game a bit, with scene designer, to change the, the color of the light in the map and uh, added some best triggers to it. Awesome. I just keep running into things. I'm glad this isn't a <laughs> one where it, it uh, rates you on your dodge ability because I, I am not winning at that. Oh. Where did that Jack Lantern guy go? I watched him win. Oh no. So it's not just his werewolf, it's like some kind of like karate werewolf. Karate werewolf? Yeah, he's wearing a gi. Yep. Obviously. Those are the most dangerous kinds. Yeah, I don't even know what happened there. Oh, that was the wrong way. Ah. 
I just got too excited and I just started shooting everywhere. That didn't actually help anything at all. Well, we got them on the ropes. Yeah. Oh, yeah. When you get them flying in the air and then I'm able to use my like spin attack, it usually goes pretty bad for, for them. Woohoo! Completed! Completed. All right. This goes a lot more smoothly when we have a full group and one of the people in our group is popcorn. <laughs> ah. Yeah, popcorn is not even super high level or anything. It's just uh, uh, knows yes. what to do. Dra Dragon Ranger uniform token. Yeah. Now you have to choose what color you want. Black, blue, pink, red, or yellow. Hmm. Oh wait, do I? That's not a quest, right? That's um, that's I just talk to him and trade it in, right? Um. Okay. Oh, my I am store is full. How did that happen? Okay. No, oh, I don't want that. Okay. I don't need this anymore. Because the event is over for that. Which I probably don't need. I did I did clear out my inventory before this. I just uh, apparently didn't do a good enough job. Alright there. Um, okay. Hello! Um uh uh, Dottie X. Hey there, how are you doing? Trade items. Oh, I have to decide. Oh, I see. Okay, so you can trade items for him. Which one do I want? Oh my gosh. Alright, I want... Um... Mm, which one are you going to choose, Oda? Uh, I went with blue. Alright, uh... with the Black Ranger set. Yay! Alright. Cool. Okay. Uh, shoes, oh, pants. Oh, out of space! Oh, I'm the worst! Uh, 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 uh. One, two, three. Okay, I should be fine. No, I'm not fine. I still need one more space. Oh, no. I'm good. There. Do do. Just gonna quickly not lose my awesome new costume. There we go. Oh, you like the blue one as well. Yeah. Yeah, I have a matching costume now. My costume hasn't been matching before. Wasn't matching before this. But yeah, this is great. Ooh, more candy. I have two husky pets. I probably don't need two of them. Ew, I'm so sorry, puppy. All right. <laughs> so I know that you can talk to uh, him again. I took my hat off. Yes, he has another quest. The quests have not ended yet. Oh, why can I just go like this and then go to there? I'm gonna turn my hat on. Oh my gosh, you can have the red nose with it there. I think my wings go really well with this costume. Alright, so talk to him again. Now I'm going to pick up the Zool quest. Use the scroll Randy gave you. Um, Randy investigated a strange voice, but didn't find out anything. He only found a strange empty scroll he wants to give you. Do the right thing. Uh, do you remember the strange voice saying Zool in between our talks? I investigated, but I didn't find anything, out anything. I just found this empty scroll which is lying on the floor. I know I'm not doing his voice right, but it has a very different voice for him that's a little creepier. <laughs> Do you want it? Maybe you can use it and find out more. Uh, except, maybe you can get to the bottom of this Zool thing. All right, so let's go ahead and do the Zool quest first. We do that before the trick or treat one, right, Popcorn? Yeah, the trick or treat uh, quest takes a bit of time. Okay. 36 uh, 
NPCs you have to visit to get all the tweets. <laughs> All right. Well, we can do that next if we have time. Or we can do at least some of it. So let's go ahead. Did you, did you pick up the... Did everyone pick up the Zool quest? Uh, I got the Zool quest. I'm trying to make some room. Uh, I need the storage. You you need a lot of inventory space. In the IM inventory as well as the consumables. Yeah. And also the... I should run over to the... Um, Maybe I should mention that if you click on the cash shop, the cash shop button, you have an IM vault where you can put IM stuff in. Oh. To make base in the IM. Eventually. Yeah, that would be awesome. How do I transfer them? How do I transfer stuff? <laughs> I so myself uh, didn't, didn't know for a long time. You can only um, put it in and save there. Can transfer to other players, then you need an account vault. But with this IM vault, you can take IM stuff and put it in to keep it safe. Oh, that's such a good idea. Now, do you have to do that right after you've bought the item, or can you transfer them? You can't transfer them over? Uh, to transfer items over, you need an account vault. Then you can transfer oh, okay. from one character to another. This is only for the particular charm. Okay. But it helps a lot if your IM inventory is full. Yeah. Okay, that, that's pretty good. Oh my gosh, I can see all these people who are going to need... And I love that they're all monsters right now. I think this is like the most fun thing ever is that everyone's a monster for Halloween. Oh my god, the baker is a little like... Oh, a little box. That's so perfect. Oh, my, my vault is full because... Well, that's that makes sense. It's full of pets because that is my obsession. Well, I'm going to be ready for Halloween when the time comes. Uh, this will be fine. Off we go. All right. Are you ready, Oda? Is everyone ready to go to Zool, I believe? We have to use a scroll, right? I don't. I just don't want to abandon everyone if I like end up... He gives us like a scroll or something, right? And then we have to use a scroll to get there? I'm gonna click on, click on the scroll. Does the scroll be in the consumables inventory? Just right click and we... Right. Oh, cool. <laughs> going I think that's pretty Huh? I think that's uh, bringing me in. Okay. Whoa! Here, here you can see the same uh, map as before, but with red light instead of blue. That is cool. Yeah, it's got a real good look. Oh my gosh, that voice. Ah! Oh, maybe that. And uh, if it's are always good while we are in the learning process to check out things like changing the color or triggering sounds. Yeah! Ah! I love that there's a dragon in here. This is my favorite part so far because of the dragon. Look uh, at it's him. A baby, it's a baby version of the dragon you will see around level 65. Awesome. Oh my gosh, yeah, he's I, super dead. I love... Uh... Oh, he's so cute. Goodbye, dead dragon. Well, it's probably that steamy candle. Oh my gosh. Ah. Wow, look at this guy. It's like a... Like a rose bush with attitude. A rose bush with attitude. Th that is Eluman. Eluman has been removed by the former, the former devs from the game. But uh, a lot of people want him back, so we have plans for him. Oh, awesome. Yeah, he looks really cool. Oh, he's like oh, a... Oh, did he turn into a little, He turned like... into a Woody. Oh. Or maybe he oh, was sweet. one... Maybe he's like the king of the Woodies. He's the... Maybe. I, I think uh, that Paris has um, put a spell on him. He was a woody before, and then he... Oh. 
And then and then he became a monster person. Did it start? I'm not moving. Hmm. Or maybe or maybe this guy wanted to be um, a bad tree. Okay. I was stuck for a minute. Were you stuck uh, for a minute? Yeah, I think it's just that uh, Popcorn did, um, everybody has to press uh, shift oh, okay. to pass, so there's one more monster remaining, Oops. watermelon, 100%. Oh. No watermelon, no, not you again, the horrifying watermelon, is this, is what, the watermelon is Zool. It all makes sense now. Uh, I like that it really moves no. <laughs> when you hit it. Like we're kind of pushing oh, it he's to moving. one side. Yeah, I think like when you hit it hard enough, it. Uh, ah. Ugh. I mean, maybe the watermelon was. Oh my gosh. No. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh, that's so funny. <laughs> I think oh a watermelon gosh, doesn't help. Oh, that's funny. Wow, <laughs> that guy. And, and, and this guy is not very strong. <laughs> no. No wonder he was hiding in the watermelon. Yeah, it's not real tough. That You know, the watermelon was a good armor. Mm-hmm. That was actually a pretty good strategy. Yeah, I like that. <laughs> All right. Do the right thing. That scientist guy needs to calm down. <laughs> that, that, that scientist guy is not very smart, I think. <laughs> no. I feel like his elaborate plan leading up to the main, like, it's like hey, bad guy monster. is way smarter than he's like, oh, well, then I'm going to have this one thing at the end. And it's like, dude, no. <laughs> Ooh. All right. Trick or treat wings. Ghost well, disturbance. I'll, I suppose I'll put on the wings. Oh, lots of the, fo the following quests are basically the same you already did. Okay. The same arcade mode, the same chaos mode, and the same scenario mode. So we could skip it. Okay. Um, so do you guys want a trick or treat? The, the trick or treat quests... Uh, are the 36 where you can get rewards. Yes. But the, the ghost disturbance quests are basically the same as the Dragon Ranger quests we had before. Alrighty. Well, I'm gonna trick or treat with uh, Randy real fast and I get these awesome wings that I think you already have. Oh my gosh, how cool. Uh, I got new wings. Oh my gosh, those are amazing. Look at this, they're amazing. So cool, they're even moving. I just gotta sit here and admire myself for a minute. All right. <laughs> um, it's it's a lot of work to get all of these treats, but they are worth it. They are worth it, that's so cool. Um, I don't have room because I was not prepared. Let's get rid of that, it's fine. This is fine. I'm sure I'll regret all my life choices soon. So remember guys, if you want to trick or treat, if you haven't yet, you just have to, I think you have to be above level 40. You have to have one of the, and you have to have one of the ranger costumes. And then go talk to the monsters. Uh, aw, treat. That's very nice of them. Hmm. Here's your treat. I don't want to trade items. Uh, I'm going to check out his items real fast to see what I need to... There's a lot of things that I... Oh, I can get a firecracker. Oh, that's terrible. I think my coffee cup is busted. Oh, no. I looked inside and was like, oh, there's a little hairline crack in there. And there's like a little bit of coffee seeping out the bottom. Like, uh, this is kind of a hard to get cup. I guess I'll just have to put in my tiki mug wall. Prison forever. Hello, Allie. Hey. It's true. That's true. Otis not wearing a hat right now. All right. As you see, I'm clearly wearing a hat. 
But I, Oda is definitely not. I will return. Oh, Oda's disappearing. I gotta attack with the sun. This is my favorite thing ever that we can trick or treat in the game. Like, I hope this happens forever. I, lo I love that they still, like, it's like they're in costume because you can still see who they are underneath. Alright, let's go. This is so cool. So this is the first year we've had Trigger Street and Dragon Saga, or no? Uh, can you repeat it, please? <laughs> oh, have we ever had... Was there... I don't remember there being trick-or-treating last year. It, it, it's the first time. Okay. First time. Oh, we okay. tried to make a 12 Days of Christmas quest chain last year, but uh, the game was a bit stubborn and uh, always abandoned these quests oh. after some minutes. Wow. Well, that was a bit uh, disappointing yeah. last year. Well, it's great that it worked this year for this. All right, let's see. Um, what is your favorite part of the Halloween uh, quest line, Popcorn? Ha. I like the Zul quest. <laughs> that makes sense. Um, um, to be honest, I, I like that you can get a costume at the end of the Dragon Ranger quest line. Yeah. Uh, this year, all is in Dragon Ranger-like quests, I would say. Trick or treat. For Trick or Treat, you need the Dragon Ranger costume, and you can get Dragon Ranger costumes for free, and you can Dragon Ranger co get Dragon Ranger costumes from the Eaton Mall. All is so really Dragon Ranger this year. Yeah, very uh, themed. But the Dragon Rangers are really cool looking, like these costumes are really neat looking. Um, and it's good that it's not just like, it's cool that it, it's not just like one costume you have to get, but there's like a bunch of different colors and they look a little different each. So yeah. it's, um, everyone can kind of look unique. Oh, Oda has a hat. Trick or treat. Hmm. I don't want that. <laughs> I feel like I probably offended her, but I'm just gonna quickly run away. Trick or treat. Ooh, okay, so you're it. going around to the different monsters and whatnot? Yes. I'm getting stuff. And I'm gonna use one of those things right now because my monster actually ran out of time. Do -do. Oh, I'm gonna change monsters too. Not that this monster wasn't amazing, but. You will also get some pet and mount food to wake up your resting pet, yeah. like Uda would say. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, resting pets. Um, Oda should definitely do some of these so that he can uh, wake them up. These have probably been resting for a very long time. <laughs> ah, okay, here I got the links. Alright. Oh, that's cool. The Friends Forever booster. All right, well, I got my happy little, uh... oh, this person. I haven't talked to this person. Oh my gosh, that's a neat looking monster. He looks like a ghost cloud. Now Oda is appropriately attired. Well, I mean, your pets have to eat, though. It makes sense. Ooh, more mouth food. Very strange is that also the car pets are eating the mount food. I imagine how I shovel this mount food into the <laughs> tank of these uh, cars. That is a good point. Uh, I would think that maybe... How do I do the trick-or-treating? Is it just... Um, so you could just go up to them and they'll have... Yeah, so oh, any of them. the NPC? Yeah, it has the green exclamation mark. There are also two NPCs in the Galaxia part of Port of the Winds. Don't oh. miss, them, miss them. And that's this part over here, right? I'm just uh, over here. In a the entrance while. is in the upper left, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> there we go. Oh, what's this Galaxy Dungeon Coin? Quest. The Galaxy Dungeon Coin can be used to get more rewards at the end of each uh, Galaxy Dungeon. Oh, neat. Hmm. I don't know if you've even done a Galaxy Dungeon. I don't think Usu it. Usually this coin is a cash shop item. Oh. But we thought we 
could give some out to test oh. for the players and for the fun. I remember the perfect hunch thing from when we did the um, the defensive mode, or was right. it? Yeah. It's 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 uh, to reveal the direction the monsters are coming from. Hmm. It's perfect hunches you can get in the rings from the F6 defense mode easier. Yeah. Mm. So there's this giant demon wearing armor who's spinning a shuriken <laughs> like a ninja star in his Where hand. Where are you? Like, Popcorn, you're right next to me. What is this? Oh, that guy. That's Master Priest William, Oda. Uh, <laughs> yes, this this guy has no quest because he refused to have one. <laughs> <laughs> he looks very intimidating, too. You, he looks you, like he's... Usually, like... It, it's, it's a monk. <laughs> but with this costume, he looks like a big whatever. <laughs> Yes. I think he just he just wants to know, um, like what is he dressed up as? Like what is his costume? Is it just like one of the the big bosses or is he just uh It's it's a normal um field monster as far as I know, or it's a boss from the Van Cliff Citadel, I'm not sure yet. Okay. Wow. Pretty well, cool. Yeah, he is scary. I, I, I think it's a boss. I think it's a boss monster from the Van Cliff Citadel. So you will see him um, in the future. Oh my gosh, there's so many people to trigger from. There are many things. And so many yeah. awesome monsters. Did you choose all these uh, popcorn? Yes. Yes. I had the help of my wife when choosing them, but... Nice. Very cool. We choose, we, we choose them and uh, we thought they totally changed the theme. <laughs> yeah, I, I love this, you know, like the, uh, the, the skeleton with the... Uh, or the, the zombie with the little serving tray, you know, he's uh, uh, the barkeep, you know, the innkeeper is kind of this uh, goblin who's sweeping. You know, yeah, they, they fit really, really well. Yeah, they're all very uh, appropriately themed. Yeah, and it's nice to see the, the monsters in Dragon Saga where you don't have to kill them because like, there's so many cool-looking monsters, but you kill them, uh, you know, you're not looking at how cool their animations are. You're like, oh, I need to need to wipe them out real quick. Yeah. That's true. All right, now I have a little bit more space, so I can trigger you to a couple more places, like the place I'm standing right now. Like, there's this guy who's this Jason Voorhees murder man who has electrical shock prod stuff. It's just some really cool monster designs. I like the some of them are themed very very well. Like the the banker, like is it like this like treasure chest? That's yeah. so cool. Ooh, more EXP boosters. I gotta do this on my other account too because this is completely amazing. Okay, armor enchant dust cube. I will. There's just it. so many. Yeah, and so a lot of these things are uh, kind of like they're usually item mall stuff. I'll come back to this later. I want to see what the other ones are. Uh, it's stuff from the item mall, but it's also stuff from the from in game, like uh, weapon enchant dust and uh, armor enchant dust and some other things from. Yeah, but there's a lot of eat em all stuff you get from these trick or treat quests. Pet option randomizer. I've never messed with those before. Let's see. With the pet option randomizer, you can change the uh, bonus stats you have on your pets. Oh. You can, you can use it, put your pet in, and you get randomly another pet option. Or pet uh, stats for your pet. That is awesome. 
You will also get Soulcraft randomizers. These are used to randomly change the stats you have on weapons and equip when you have Soulcrafted these items. See, I knew that was a thing. I didn't realize there was a pet one. That's kind of cool. I really like Daisy's costume. <laughs> that monster looks really, really cool. It's it's Paris. Oh, it. It's actually Paris. Paris in uh, in her last form you will see in the game. Okay, I was like, that doesn't remind me of the Paris costume I've seen, but I haven't. This, I didn't see her final form. This Paris in, in this form you will see. Uh, in, at about level 65 to 70. It's the boss monster of the Dracos Tower, floor 50. Wow. Well, we will we'll get there eventually. We're like halfway? No, not even. Probably. I'm actually checking out this... Um... Uh, right kind of in the middle of town they have all the uh, the cutouts. Oh, yeah Okay, I'm gonna come back here later, but I don't want to I just want to see if there's All right, I'm gonna see I remember last year we took some picture with this, pictures screenshots with the cutouts Let's see do I fit there's some of them that I remember was like You have to line it up just right. <laughs> Whoa. That is an interesting costume choice. They are making unhappy noises. Butter. Yeah, I mean, look at this monster. This guy is huge. I, mean, he's laughing. I bet it would be difficult to wear that. Oh, like, great. Like Flower, head, thanks. Like, I mean, unless it's like some kind of like illusion and not an actual costume, that looks like it'd be very difficult to wear, like that much armor. I think it's all armor. This is some kind of like <laughs> full metal alchemist thing. Yeah, giving lots of cooking supplies, butter and whatnot. Oh, nice. Now I'll be prepared to make stuff on those recipes. It's kind of fun that these guys hand out the cooking supplies. Yeah. Yeah, I think this this guillotine is really my favorite one of these. <laughs> uh, I like the ghost one. Let's see. Oh, that's not it. <laughs> <laughs> I, I like the little details of, like, your hands um, are through that. the... <laughs> you know, it looks like your hands are through the holes and also your feet. Yeah. This is a fun little touch. That is. Also, there's like bat wings on the guillotine. It's just fun, like you know. My wings don't don't work with these as well. Ah, I'm gonna get there. I bet there are people who are much better at this than than I am. I'm like, cannot line up. Face is not correct. But I love the Halloween um, themed of this city. Like even. Even before yeah, the monsters so took fun. over, I think every all the electrical. Ooh, pet dye potion! Yes. So in case the pet dies. No. <laughs> For the pet dye potion, it's not possible to dye all pets. Only mounts can be dyed. Okay. Also, you won't find this pet dye potion or the pet name changer in your inventory. Oh. It's in the it's in the mount inventory. Oh, the pet has its own inventory, because many people are asking if this quest is not working correctly. Mm -hmm. The reward goes into the mount inventory. Interesting. I see. I see. And it has to be like if you have a mount. I think the only mount I have on this character is my griffin. I think I'm gonna save that. Uh, the, the the griffin is not paintable. Uh, you can, for example, recolor the tiger, the liger, the golden dragon, the squirrel, the sugar glider, and the lizard. 
I'll have to see about I'm gonna have to see about taming one of those and dyeing it for the next live stream. That sounds exciting. Also, when you are recoloring it, it's, uh, it chooses one random color out of a set of different textures. Oh, cool. You get a random color. So if you want to have another color, you need another pet dye potion. That makes sense. Recipes. Recipes. Give me all the recipes. Alright, I need to go to the bank. Yeah. My bank is completely full. I don't know about yours, so I'm just yeah, like making I, I hard suspect. choices. <laughs> okay, so the recipes are over here, so. Well, it's not too bad. It's because I kept getting more pets. I just, I need to collect all the pets, and that's difficult. Oh, Edelid's costume. That's funny. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff that I got in here. It's like, oh, you know, why did I even bother storing this? This is like a level nine pants. It's not even for my it class. Was, it was like an emotional thing. You're like, these were my nope, level nine anymore. pants, and they, they got me through my level nine stuff, so... You wanted to keep them. I close think it was like, oh, always. I can't, I can't upgrade it, or I can't disassemble it into. Oh yeah, I know. The RO oh, stuff will definitely hang on to. If you want to keep everything, you can use your character vault. You can uh, enlarge it, for example, with. Um, Vault expansion item from the cash shop. <laughs> yeah, I think before the next live stream, we're going to have obtained some of those and have a lot more space. I have like cooking ingredients in here. It doesn't what, even make what sense. We, what we changed for the vault expansion mm -hmm. is that if you buy one from the cash shop, it's now unlimited for the character vaults. Nice. It does not expire anymore. Well, that's that's good. I'm not willing to throw any of this stuff away. It's all stuff I like. Mm. Nope, I like it all. I won't throw it away. No one can make me. Let's see, do I have any repeats of stuff? I have stuff from over there. I can go back oh, there, if, I if if you get this weapon dust cube, uh, it's a stack of 999 weapon dust compressed into a cube. Wow. You can uncompress it when going to the Soulcraft NPC, Julie, mm -hmm. which is in the middle of the town in the lower part where the Paris NPC is. Yeah. And there you can put it in when choosing the menu option uh, item exchange, something like that. Item exchange. There you can put it in and you can then, with trade, get your 999 weapon and armor dust from these cubes. Oh, that's cool. All right. These, these cute cubes have been added to a safe inventory space if you have a lot of it. The same can be done with souls. They are compressed into purification stones. You can compress can also compress these uh, things by yourself by putting 999 of these items into and you get the compressed version of them back. So oh, we can nice. always exchange the one for the other. Let's do that then. Although I think I don't have enough. I can do it like once but I can't do it more than that. Let's see I got, I got some souls too that I can do that. Ooh that's neat. Alright, trade. I have a lot of souls. I have like which feels awful to say. Like I'm a monster person. Uh, uh, these these <laughs> cubes and these purification stones are stackable, so you can stack nine hundred and ninety nine of these stones or cubes and it uh, saves a lot of space in your inventory. That is awesome. Ooh, watermelon slices, perfect. Yeah, watermelon slices. We've been missing those. They were like, where are watermelon slices? Because I know I used all of mine. 
I got a lot of EXP potions too. I'm going to use them the next time we live stream. Absolutely. So we can power level our way through the but world. What was that? Hey, Card of Joy. How you doing? Hey there. Happy Wednesday. We were just trick or treating. Trick or treating. Lens. Running around town, seeing these cool costumes these monsters got. Playing the inventory game quite a lot. Yeah. I can't get rid of my llama. I say that all the time. All right. Well. Um, well, I think that kind of about wraps up our Halloween adventure, though. Um, we've seen quite a bit of the, the trick-or-treating. We went through the scenario mode. We did the Zool quest, which was super cool. That matches. And also, anyways. Um, yeah, uh, so when does this run until? Oh, it's for another two weeks. So. Uh, the, the trick or treat is ending today. Oh, the trick Ooh. or treat is ending today. Wow. But the Halloween event is going to be here for the two weeks, right? The trick or treat quest has been really added for the event, uh, for, for the Halloween day. Okay. This is why it was in, and we wanted to give a real Halloween feeling okay. with these quests. Oh, very cool. Yeah, that is awesome. But the Halloween event itself will still be here, like the missions for another two weeks on it. One thing I wanted to, to mention is um, that uh, it's not it's not the, the funniest thing, but it's very important to, to mention. I just wanted to remind all the players who are watching now that buying gold from gold sellers and gold seller websites is not tolerated and not allowed and can result in a permanent suspension of accounts. Yeah. That's very important to me that the players know about this. Yeah. Don't mm -hmm. don't buy gold, guys. That's our so gold. That's a that's a way to lose your account and everything in it forever. Yeah, and we're able to detect that stuff. So like just don't take the risk. Don't do it. Yeah. You don't want to lose your Dragon Saga characters and all the stuff you've gathered. And we don't want you to either. We want you to stay with us, so. Right. If someone's like, oh, this is normal. It's not normal. Don't believe them. They're filled with lies. I'm sorry, what were you saying, Popcorn? Uh, can you repeat, please? Well, oh, I was just asking. I thought you were you were saying something. Uh, no. OK. <laughs> <laughs> Um, it's, that, it's just this message I wanted to um, to forward is uh, something that I am I don't think it's funny but I think the players should know that gold selling is not allowed some of the players think it's nothing big and uh, I think they should know yeah definitely um, that is a like one of the more like more serious, like things you could do that's wrong in the, the game. The problem is uh, actually people tell them, oh, it's okay to buy gold from mm -hmm. sites yeah. and gold sellers, it's no problem, but it is actually a problem. And uh, we don't tolerate and we don't want it here because it takes away the fun from the game, it is a risk and it's not worth it in my opinion. Yeah, I mean, it's cheating and right. the terms of use are really clear about it so those that's the thing you kind of like agreed to before you logged into the game and so i know some people might have like skimmed over some of it mm -hmm. um but yeah that's it's it's definitely a very serious like um problem if you do that in the game and if like and we do like again like otis said detect that and then we'll have to like suspend your account and you'll lose all your stuff, so don't do that. Don't buy or don't listen to anyone who says that's like 
Okay. okay. And if they do, then actually we'd really appreciate it if you'd report it to us in a ticket. Um, send a ticket into our support team and let them know about it so we can get rid of it and it'll make the game a better place for everyone. Yeah. So thank you folks so much for watching. Thank you, Popcorn, uh, for for helping us through this adventure. And uh, anytime. Uh, what do you guys plan to do next week? Um, well, we've finished the Halloween quest. Uh, we've got more hero quest stuff to tackle, I think. I think we probably maybe want to go through lava, the, that fire dungeon, the fire dragon dungeon. I know I'm going to say the name wrong. Oh, if I say boy. It right now. Yeah, that was a la, tough la, one. La, la, Lavalon? Lavalon. Yeah, we're going to yeah. go to Lavalon. If, if you do Lavalon again, I would be uh, glad to help again. Awesome. We can definitely use the help, because going through just the two of us was tough. Yeah, we're definitely not going to be able to do Lavalon uh, on our own. If you, if you know the tricks, uh, this boss is not too hard to do. Okay. Yeah, I know we were getting the advice last time, and I know it's supposed to be one of the more difficult ones, so we'll try to get a full group for that one, and it'd be awesome if you could help. Um, so, again, thank you for joining us, and thank you, everyone. In